but you have to do that and get it retwisted of course i don't retwist my hair i haven't done that yet i might do I might try to do that maybe and do a video for you guys before it comes. Welcome to another video guys. Today is a little different. I'm gonna do it in my car. Uh, I drive a little bit for Uber and Lyft and stuff like that. It's a cool gig. And I want to talk to y'all about some things. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just got to have some real, real conversation that goes, basically that goes down in real life, right? Like when I make content, is to make people smile, to make people have fun and, and all that. But at the same time, there's another world from there. I'm not too uh, uncomfortable not to share. And so, basically, yeah, I'm going to tell y'all what it is, okay? So, I've been having my dreads for about seven months. So, all you see right here is legit. And here you see from, from here down is new growth. See that? It's like a pile throughout my whole hair. It looks cool, but... The main thing that I, I would like to talk to you guys about is the fact that I have thought about cutting my hair just because it might be a little personal. No, it's not really personal. It's, I feel like a lot of people do go through this and uh, it's, it's the phase where you like, this is a phase usually that happens whenever you start dress, right? And you have dress for a little while your hair is not that long it doesn't look good so you want to cut it so i want to cut my dreads yes i want to cut my dreads literally like i'm not playing like y'all seen some of the videos that i've been doing recently the stores haircut in the stores pranks and challenges and stuff like that kind of lets you know which direction i want to head this channel towards to but i know that a lot of people would like to see progress that I made with this hair, uh, the things that I do, the styles that I rock with, uh, which is the support is so amazing and I'm really appreciative, by the way. I don't, I don't know if I have said thank you yet, but I thank you for everybody that clicks on my videos to watch them and like it and share it, even if you don't do any, any of that, just to go through the video and to get something from it or to see something or anything that helped you out, I'm happy, okay? So I would like to say thank you for that. But the reason why I wanna cut it is because my scalp is, uh, it gets very dry fast, like real fast. And growing up, I had uh, more danger than my brothers. So I have an older brother that I grew up with and I have a younger brother. I have more younger brothers, but uh, younger brothers have that same issue that I have, and me. My older brother don't, the middle one don't. It's like, we, it's five brothers. It's five boys and one girl. And so, uh, the second to the last has that, and the second one, which is me. The second one from the first, which is me. I have that issue, right? And so what happens is my skin gets dry real fast, and it causes my hair to have a lot of buildup uh, under the new growth. And of course, taking care of your hair is necessary. Of course, washing your hair is necessary. But at the same time, washing this type of hair and drying this type of hair it takes a long time. It's not. It's not something like with an afro you can do, or with a short hair you can do, or with a waves you can do. Uh, takes a lot of maintenance right and so I've been getting a lot busy and I haven't been able to maintain it and so it got to a point where last time I looked at my hair I don't know if you guys can see but there's a lot of dandruff right see all that that's a whole that's a whole bunch of dandruff man that's a whole bunch of it so I did a rinse or whatever like a few months ago and I helped it, right? But I, if 
found out that I have to do that not every two months or so, but every two weeks or every month. But you have to do that and get it retwisted, of course. I don't retwist my hair. I haven't done that yet. I might do... I might try to do that maybe and do a video for you guys before cutting it. I don't know, man. But hopefully I will be able to make time and truly like I'm blessed to where I'm at, where I'm at today in this life, the the journey that I'm going to, um, being engaged and all that stuff. Got my new crib. And so a lot been going on, right? And so what I'm trying to say is I'm trying to find time to do this, but I feel like a lot of things been getting in the way for me to take care of my dreads. The main reason I went to dreads in the beginning was actually to, to not be responsible. <laughs> Dealing with my hair every day with the other hair I had, the afro and the curly and doing the twist. Like doing all that stuff, like I got tired of it, so I went to dress so that could save me time, but it ended up being not even more harder, but in a way challenging in itself just because I've never done it. I've never done it. I've never had a dress before, and so maintaining it is becoming a pain, you know? And like if I had an afro, okay, wash it real quick, dry it, get out the shower, right? This is not, this is not how it goes down with this dreads. This dreads, you at least take it from one hour to two hours to do all that stuff and to dry it. And blow dry is bad for your hair. Too much heat is bad for your hair in general. And so, if you try to do it naturally, it takes more. But, yeah man, that's what I would like to talk to y'all about. Uh, see what you guys' thoughts are in the comments. Please, if you've seen this video, anything that you want to you know, you want to throw your advice or anything like that, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead, comment down. Um, I will definitely share. I'll, I'll definitely read it and respond to it. Yes. Thank you. Have a blessed.